Hello, in this video I will show you how to use Nominatium API to get coordinates of an address. If you create a website like Airbnb, you may need the coordinates of the room of the user. So you can show the position of a room on map. Airbnb uses Google Maps API, but we gonna use OpenStreetMap because it's free. I have a video that shows how to use Leaflet, GS, and OpenStreetMap. You find a link in description of this video. We can search coordinates of a city by its name. If the name don't exist, we get the message, sorry, no result. We can search by city name or by full address, number and the name of the street. You can also search by zip code. Let's start this project. First, I'm gonna create a container. Inside this container, I'm gonna add input field, type text, placeholder address, and ID address. I'm gonna add a button search. And I'm gonna add a div with ID results. I'm gonna use style to redesign the web page. I'm gonna set the text online of the class container center. I'm gonna change the height and the font size of uh, input and button. I'm gonna set the width of the input 500 pixels and the margin top 100 pixels. I'm gonna set the margin top of the button 10 pixels, background a dark green, color of text white, and the width 200 pixels. In H over, I'm gonna change the background color and the color of the text. Now we can start writing the script. First, I'm gonna create a variable for the input to get its value. I'm gonna create a function find address to get the coordinates. I'm gonna create a variable URL because we'll get the address and the coordinates from an API plus the value of the input. I will put a link to the script in description. I'm gonna use fetch to get coordinates and the address. Fetch URL, then get the JSON response. Then I'm gonna save the data in an array. I'm gonna call it address array. Then I'm gonna print the value of array on console. Finally, I'm gonna use cache to get the error. Let's try the function on console. It didn't work. I can't use console.log without creating a function. I'm gonna call it show. Now it must work. On console, we can see that I get an array of one object. There is a variable display name. It contains address. 
and variables lat for latitude and long for longitude. I'm gonna add an event to the button on click find address. We can see on console that the event works. For London, we get three addresses. To get the latitude of the first address, we use its index in array 0 and the name of the variable latitude lat. Next, we're gonna show addresses on web page. I'm gonna create a variable for the div results so I can change its inner HTML. I'm gonna create a function to show addresses of uh, address array. result.html equal empty string. If address array dot length greater than zero, I'm gonna use for each loop to show addresses. Results.html plus equal div. I'm gonna create a class results. I'm gonna use concatenation to show address. The name of the variable is display name. In fetch, I'm gonna remove cancel.log and I will use the function show address. Let's try on browser. I get three addresses for London. I will add a style to the class results. I'm gonna add margin to button. Now I'm gonna add the latitude and the longitude. Like you see on browser, it works. I hope it works for you also. Finally, we're gonna add a message if we don't get a result. Else result.html equal. I'm gonna set the color of uh, the text red. Not found. This is the end of this video. Take care.